Hello everyone, and as you can see on my screen here, we've gotten a big announcement again today. Two new kits, a Bill Buy kit, Party Essentials, and a Cass kit, Urban Homage. So, let's talk about these. It says here on Twitter, from the streets of London to Willow Creek, Flaunty Bonix's classic collection of nostalgic fashion trends with the collaborative The Sims 4 Urban Homage Kit or Dazzle and Delight with playful party props in the new The Sims 4 Party Essentials Kit. And they're coming out on April 18th, which is next week. And then this one goes on to say, Strut boldly as the ultimate virtual style icon with Ebonics's The Sims 4 Urban Homage Kit. Dress your sim from head to toe in unapologetic pieces inspired by a time and place near and dear to Ebonics. Wow, that's amazing. Those are amazing pieces. In the first screenshot, you can see the butterfly top in the background with a little, like, uh, jean mini skirt. That's pretty fabulous. And those shoes. I love those shoes so much. We've got this cute head wrap. And I gotta say, there's another screenshot um, coming up in a second where it's even prettier. But this one's good, too. Uh, and then we have this top, this green top. It's almost like a bustier. No, is it? Kind of, I guess. But at any rate, it's adorable. I love it. I can see using that here and there. The, the pants, on the other hand, are not really my style, to be honest. Uh, I don't love them. I don't love that style of clothing very much. Not that these aren't well done because they look awesome, but I, I'm just, I'm not a cast girl anyways. And, you know, especially that kind of style of clothing, not really my thing. And then we have the second screenshot and I don't love the men's fashion. <laughs> I, I, you know, it's okay. It's nothing special. Uh, I'm not really, again, into fashion anyways, but, like, even less into men's fashion, if that's possible. I do love the gorgeous, vibrant red uh, head covering. That is absolutely beautiful. And then the top that goes with it, it's gorgeous. We see that mini skirt again, and then in the background we see uh, a couple of outfits. It looks like a pair of pants and two similar shirts, maybe? They're both really good. I I like those. I can see myself using the women's fashion for sure from this kit. It's all very gorgeous. The men's, eh, I mean, take it or leave it. It's okay. I especially don't like the pants, you know, but that that jean vest over the white t-shirt, I really don't like that one at all. I don't know why. I just, it's not my favorite. Now, my passion lies in decorating and building. So I am most excited for the Build By Kit. And we've got so much stuff here. We've got the Freezer Bunny Neon Light. We've got the sign in the background, the Disco Ball. The new balloons, the weird thing on the wall between the TV and the bar. I never understood that kind of stuff. Like, even in real life, you have these sheet, plastic sheets that have pictures printed on them that you're, I don't know, supposed to hang up at parties or something. I never really got the concept of those myself. But, you know, they're there. We've got a new speaker. It looks like we have new things like streamer type things hanging down from the ceiling if you look up at the top. Uh, we've got this awesome uh turntable console system here and then the fog machine all these little party clutter things on the table over here like this is uh, i like it i like this party kit and then in the second picture you can see the disco ball a little better the balloons a little better it looks like we've got 
like lights maybe hanging on the walls and then more of those plastic sheet things with the pictures hanging on the walls it also looks like maybe streamer type curtains hanging over the windows in the background you can see sort of in the background that party clutter again and then in the front corner more of that party clutter there yeah i think we can use more party clutter in the game i guess that's just me personally but i've always felt like one of the things that was really truly missing is like the ceiling streamers that you see at the top there and the balloons i really felt like we've always been missing true balloons in the game and so me personally i'm glad to see them so these kits are going to be available next week on april 18th on point looks and new party vibes we've got the urban homage and the party essentials kit and as you can see on the screen here we've got new tops two new three new four new five six seven eight nine ten new tops so that's really awesome oh 11 i forgot the butterfly how could i forget that gorgeous butterfly top we've got nails a new set of jewelry earrings and rings we've got the head scarf we've got a mini skirt and a like four different pairs of pants and then this longer short skirt thing oh five different pairs of pants uh and then we have the shoes i love these shoes the mini isolation shoes are like them oh yeah and we have the necklace down here that i missed i didn't even see that at first so that's quite a bit of awesome stuff and probably the swatches that i'm seeing here are not something that i like but probably a lot of these will have swatches that i will like the only thing i will say is this yellow jacket with white like tube top thing that does seem vaguely similar to something we already have in the game as does a couple of these vest t-shirt and jacket shirt type things uh, the sports jersey type thing like maybe it's because I'm not into fashion or maybe it's because there are only so many different things that you can do with clothing but I do kind of feel like me personally having all of the packs I'm starting to see things that are starting to get very very similar in style uh, kind of repeated a little bit here and there. But certainly, if you don't have some of the other packs that have these styles in them, this will be great for you. And it's only a $5 kit, so that makes it even better. And then we have the party kit. So here are all the items that come with that. Hanging lights, a stand light, a floor light, this, like, plastic sheet picture thing, the uh disco ball the smoke machine the streamers the cake stand i can't really tell what that is very well some clutter items speakers uh we've got all sorts of things here i don't know what that butterfly is though i don't remember seeing that in the screenshots but wait oh i bet you it's the neon light some more streamer things the turntable the balloons we've even got a little bench here like there are so many things here to add to parties it's gonna be really awesome so this little part from the website is quite interesting the party is just getting started. Step onto the scene in the trendiest threads. Set the stage for unforgettable celebrations this season in The Sims 4. To me, that kind of sounds like a hint for the future. Like, we know the 10th anniversary of The Sims 4 is coming up later this year. And it's not saying get the party started with this fashion and party essentials kit it's saying the party is just getting started meaning that there's more to come so i don't know could that be a little hint to the future i guess we'll have to wait and see I'm excited. I'm always excited to add more stuff to the game. I'm not a huge custom content fan. 
I prefer having the officially released, like, quote-unquote vanilla stuff, if you will. And so this always excites me to have more stuff to add to the game. And to me, they just get better and better with time. And especially when they collaborate with Simmers, they... It just is so much better. It's They make awesome things when they do that. And this cast kit is no exception to that. So I'm excited to get these into my game. What do you guys think of these new kits? Let me know down in the comments below. And as always with everything lately, I will be running a giveaway very, very soon for a winner of the Party Essentials kit and a winner of the Urban Homage kit. So, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you're enjoying this channel, and watch for those giveaways coming very, very soon. And yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye!